New week. New week. New week. I'm almost looking at me like I'm a crazy person. It's, it's to my understanding that uh, I keep losing people at the start of my videos. There's a few folk that are quite a lot. The majority of people click on the video and then watch for about two minutes and then fall out in love with the video. So I have to keep these videos engaging for the whole time. So this is going to be my mission this week, is to keep it as engaging as possible. So you do not click away. Watch this whole video. Yeah, I'm talking to you. It's a new week. Happy new week. Let's go. Look at this. I'm calling my, my last vlog PS5 unboxing. Just in, as an attempt to bring in the viewers. It's clickbait. But, do I feel guilty for it? No. <laughs> Um, look at this as well. Oh, copyright complaint for a video here for my weightlifting routine video for some of the songs. But but I bought I uh, I got the songs from a website like a, a royalty free website where you pay money for it. So that's bullshit. So. And then this one here, my first video, that's got a copyright claim because uh, I used a Mariah Carey, I was singing to a Mariah Carey song. Mariah Carey, if you're watching this video, can I use your song please? Can I get rid of that copyright claim? Can I share this video so Mariah Carey sees this video? Please. This here was an heirloom. It's a family heirloom, it's been passed on through generations. My mum uses it to put on hair bands, which I think is quite disrespectful to other ancestors to take that off. But it's a beauty. There's some bright colours to keep it engaging, keep the video engaging. Bananas, tropical, chocolate coins, or Harry Potter gold. You decide. Engaging. Board. Attention. Board. Engaged. Board. Engaged. He's engaged. Some people may be wondering where I got my gold chain. I, uh, Year is it now? 2020. I fought in Afghanistan. No, I'm not. Delete this video. Something I've not had yet is a dislike. Every video has been 100% liked. So I'm worried. I'm worried how I'm going to handle this. I think this newest video is going to get a dislike. At least one dislike. We'll see. Because it is a troll video, basically. It's, you know, it's obviously a wee bit of entertainment, but the thumbnail is misleading. But, you know, it's the price you've you got to pay to get some clickbait. Heads are a pretty mental concept, eh? Like, we each look at each other's heads, that's how we communicate. Your head is like your, well, as I say, it's your central nervous system, it's, it's, your, it's the, the base of your central nervous system. It's the the mothership and then everything else serves the head. It's mental. It's just mental. It's just this balloon on top of a body. Weird. You know what else is mental? The sort of the idea how like in a plant you get the base root and then you get from it you get the the branches. And that sort of same pattern is found in living creatures as well. Well, a plant is a living creature, but even like a human or a dog. I'm speaking to the camera. Like, for example, you've got his head, and then you've got, oh, he's great. You've got his spine coming down, and then from that, you've got all the nerves and whatnot. 
just like a tree. So do you reckon trees, do you reckon trees and, and creatures at one point branched off on the, you know, like the evolution, on the, what do you call it, the evolution tree? I don't know what it's called that, I've totally forgotten biology. What do you call that? Species tree or whatever, whatever it's called. Um, do you think trees branched off, pardon the pun, from other creatures? Who knows, maybe, maybe. So I said next week, or you know, by this week, um, I'd be given a bit of cannibalism a go, so here goes. This here's a joint from a human. Now there's a cemetery near where I live, so um, we'll manage to dig a body and get some meat. So here goes, I'll give it a go, I'll see how I'll get back to you and how, what it tastes like, but I'm sure it tastes good, it looks good. As you can see, walnuts look like brains. I've got a bit of a tragic story on how walnuts came to be. I'm not sure if you've heard of this before. But walnuts came back when there was a... Back during the time when there was other primates than humans. The walnut people. We oppressed them and we forced them to live underground. Why? Because they were a valuable food source. Their brains were full of fat, their blood full of sugar. So they made tasty meals during the winter when fruit was scarce. Uh, but yeah, basically we, we went after the walnut people. We oppressed them for centuries and they were forced to live underground. And then eventually, living underground just didn't work well with them. Um, so eventually they perished. And their brains, these walnuts, were buried under underground. They grew through the soil into trees, and that's how we get walnut trees. So whenever you see a walnut tree, remember it's the oppression of the walnut people. It's, you know, I, I'll, I'll never, I don't think I'll ever, they'll never sit well with me that our ancestors done that, it's tragic. So, I'm thankful for these walnuts. Every time I, I eat a walnut, I always pay my gratitude towards the walnut people and their sacrifice. Um, yep. Bloody horrible. But it tastes good. But it's horrible. Rest in peace to the walnut people. Five K run Tuesday. Yay! Terrible run. Me and my mum went to a pet shop today um, and we've seen a dog hat. So we've put, we could try it on Colin. Hilarious. Another day, no food. Oh, pardon me. My mum's doing it as well today. I look terrible. I look like death. doing it as well. So we were supposed to be meeting up and going into the tea, the river tea that's uh, Dundee's river, jumping in it for for New Year. Um, that was part of a, of a duke in the freezing cold war. But, you know, it was going to be an experience. Well, I think we're still going to do it, we're still going to do it, but this happened for nine. So, that's what happened. 
so it's happening so in 45 minutes time we are going into the river Tay we are jumping into the sea into the North Sea in January look outside look at that snow that's how cold it is that's what sort of temperature we've got right now why? Why are we doing this? Because some old man said it was good for you. Some Wim Hof did said it was good for you. Oh my god. Oh my god, man. Hey man. Surf's up, bro. Got my wetsuit on. Ready. Kinda. Here in Roy Ferry. <coughs> About to jump in that water right there. Happy days. Good luck, bro. Just dive in now. Did you wet foot in? <laughs> what the hell? That was good like, um, at one point I dived under and my head went under the water and it, it was just a total brain freeze, it was the worst, but nah it was good, I'm still shivering like, finally got a light from a fish tank, an LED light instead of the one that was in there. It's all lit up. We've got a remote here too that I can use to change the colours. Put it on smooth. The problem is it changes really fast. I don't know if that's gonna mess up the fish. I wish I could slow down a bit. So I might just keep on the white option. That's cool. Just about to go for another run. Um, I'm gonna start framing all my exercises and all my runs and all my, you know, like jumping in the sea and stuff. I'm gonna all frame it as disaster training, training for disaster, training for the apocalypse, training, you know, for survival. Um, I just think it'd be a cool way to to train. Uh, it would, you know, it'd give me an edge. Watching the UFC right now. Uh, I'm a big fan of the UFC. Mixed martial arts for anyone not knowing what it is. <coughs> Used to do it for a wee bit. It wasn't very good, but I might go back to it eventually. Uh, anyway, um, Pontenebio, Santiago Pontenebio is fighting. He's a fighter from Argentina. Uh, from Argentina. Uh, so that should be good. Good to see him. I seen him live fighting in Glasgow, here in Scotland. Like. 2016 I think it was. It was a brilliant fight. Unreal. Totally smashed the dude to like. Anyway, ciao. <laughs> I should add there's an Argentinian fighter. Uh, wait for it to focus. I should add there's an Argentinian fighter uh, on this card for the UFC tonight. Don't stop. Wait, I've already said this. Shit. Righto, that's it for this week. Um, if you liked the video, give it a share 
or not. If you liked it, give it a like. If you think it's worthy of a share, give it a... Ah, I'm getting, I need to change this. I'm getting bored of this. Um, hey, do you like the video? Perhaps you want to give it a like. Perhaps leave a comment to to let me know that you've seen the video. Then you've that you've got to the end. Um, do you want to share it with your friends on Facebook on on whatever platform? Go for it, man. Go for it. Or women, go for it. Uh, and what's the other option? Like, comment, share, subscribe. If you want to see more of these videos, subscribe. Please. 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 Um, yeah. Not much content this week. It's been pretty boring. It's not, uh, it's not been boring. It's just been a slow week. There's been some good highlights, but I've not done much this week.